So hi, hello and welcome, Microbe Hunter here again and uh, I would like to add a little bit of alcohol to this uh, little Daphnia here, Daphnia that's a water flea, because I'd like to see and observe and experiment what effect alcohol has on the behavior uh, of this water flea. And of course, <laughs> I wouldn't be making this video uh, if there were no effect. Of course, uh, there is going to be a remarkable change. And specifically, I'd like to show you the effect of alcohol on the heartbeat uh, of this little water crustaceans. So uh, first of all, uh, these little Daphnia are uh, basically tiny little, uh, pro probably maybe a two or three millimeter uh, large uh, little, uh, uh, yeah, they're not insects, uh, they are crustaceans and this means they're related to the crabs and, and uh, to the shrimp and uh, they ha can be bought as fish food and this is basically where I got it from. And uh, I got um, yeah, a few hundred of them here, I kept them in the little jar over here and they're happily swimming around reproducing, some of them are indeed also pregnant, I was able to see some eggs and some tiny little um, water fleas in there as well. And uh, I decided to, to simply um, yeah, put them on a microscope slide and add a little bit of alcohol um, to those water fleas to see how their behavior changes. And of course, uh, they do have a nervous system, even if the nervous system is quite simple and much uh, simpler than our human nervous system, of, of course, alcohol still does have an effect. And uh, yeah, there are actually far too many of them now on the microscope slide for this reason. I had to remove a few of those. Um, I also did not want uh, to harm uh, too many of them. So I just basically removed all of them except one. And I also used my uh, pipette uh, to remove any excess uh, water because of course I'll be adding a little bit of alcohol and this is basically yeah, what we've got here. Okay, The water flea is happily moving around um, and they're called water fleas because of their uh, fast uh, rapid movement. It looks almost like they're jumping uh, like fleas uh, through the water. Okay, well, um, let's uh, start the experiment uh, right now. Yeah, I'm, what I'm doing here right now is I'm adding a little bit of alcohol to some water. I'm diluting the alcohol, otherwise it's way too concentrated. I do not want to harm uh, the da Daphnia, so I want to uh, uh, yeah, use an appropriate concentration of alcohol. And then I simply added a drop um, of uh, this diluted alcohol solution on, yeah, on the Daphnia and I put it directly under the microscope and I, yeah, I also added some alcohol directly um, under uh, yeah, the microscope. So this was my pipette right now. Maybe I'm just going to show you again. Let's uh, rewind this a little bit yeah, so that you see what I've been doing here. So this is the, yeah, the Daphnia and uh, this little large uh, structure. This here is my pipette where I'm adding another drop. And then now look um, a little bit at the heart. Okay, So the heart um, of the Daphnia can be found here um, yeah, on the back. Okay, So focus on this and, and look what happens. Uh, look what happens uh, to the heartbeat. Okay, so let's move the arrow again out of the way and let's continue. Yeah, and look, um, it starts to slow down quite a bit and it also starts to pump a little bit uh, irregularly. Now it's very slow. Yeah, and now it's faster again. <laughs> then it slows down again. Yeah, and then it speeds up again. But then um, later on, it actually stays relatively slow. Okay, so um, the alcohol does um, yeah, have a remarkable um, influence um, on the heartbeat of this little uh, water flea here. And uh, of course, later on, I would like to reverse it again. And uh, of course, if you add too much alcohol, you end up killing the Daphne. Is something, of course, I did not want to do that because I wanted to observe its change in behavior. Yeah, um, but uh, just right now at the beginning, at the video is going to loop in just a second. Yeah, we can actually then see um, yeah, that uh, I diluted this proximal, maybe about 1 to 10 because it was concentrated alcohol. Yeah, so maybe I'm getting around a 10% um, alcohol solution um, over here. And uh, this was uh, generally fine. And then when I added it uh, to the Daphnia, then I quickly had to put it under the microscope uh, so that uh, uh, the effect of the alcohol could be seen uh, right away. And look, look, uh, look right now, um, look at the speed, uh, look at the speed of the heart. Uh, yeah, right now, yeah, and then see what happens when I add more alcohol, okay? Um, yeah, you see it's, it's uh, pretty fast, yeah, and then I'm adding more alcohol and then it starts to almost immediately starts to slow down. So I was actually also a little bit uh, quite surprised uh, by the, uh, the speed uh, that uh, the alcohol is able to slow down the heartbeat. Okay, uh, of course I wanted to reverse everything again. So what I've done is I've taken the pipette and I removed uh, um, all of the excess alcohol and I re added some water. And uh, let's have a look here, okay? So I have now added water 
And then actually what we expect is, is we expect the heart to start beating faster again. And indeed this did happen. Um, however, um, I had to wait, I don't know, approximately 10 minutes, <laughs> 10 minutes or so. I did not want to wait uh, that long here uh, yeah, in the video. So for this reason, I basically then want to show you um, yeah, what happens after a couple of minutes. And uh, this is then when the heartbeat, yeah, right now, this is several minutes later, yeah, uh, starts to speed up uh, again quite back to the original uh, to the original rate. Yeah, so this actually shows that this uh, effect is also reversible. But there's a second thing that happened. Notice that the whole daphnia also started to move again because the alcohol not only slowed down the heartbeat, but generally the movement of the daphnia itself. Yeah, and now um, as the heart starts beating faster, the whole water flea also starts uh, to move a little bit more. Yeah, so very interesting uh, and easy to do little experiment uh, with also water fleas, of course. Um, yeah, it's all possible to try also other um, tiny water animals, um, how they respond to a variety of environmental pollutants and chemicals. And in this case, of course, also alcohol. And now you can see that we're all the way back to the normal heart, heart rate again. Well, um, yeah, that's it for today. Hope that you liked the video. Do please uh, consider subscribing uh, to this uh, channel if you like these videos. Yeah, I wish you all the best. Uh, happy microbe hunting as always. And uh, see you around next time. Bye bye.